This is Universe Website Builder Part 2. Hey everyone, what's happening? This is Tim Brown today. I want to revisit the Universe Website Builder app for iOS, that is for the iPhone. And I want to show you three tips that I think can extend the functionality of your site. If you haven't used this yet, check out my earlier review. Today I want to cover three things. How you can add SoundCloud to your site, how you can customize an icon for your site, and three, how to add embed code. Okay, the first thing I want to show you is how to add SoundCloud. Pretty straightforward. What you do is you tap on an available spot on your website and you and you scroll through the widgets that come up as as a menu option and you select soundcloud it's the familiar soundcloud symbol and then you're going to search soundcloud for the file that you're looking for in my case i created an episode called photoscape x here it is just tap on it and just like that it's added to my site next you can also customize elements or icons for your website so in my case i have this really cool filter that i used the problem is that you really can't use this these these design elements on your other pages so what i did was i just did a little screenshot of my site like so and then went into a photo editor say like uh bizarre or something really you know simple and easy to use and i just set up a square format for my composition and then just went in and imported one of those screenshots into my website and just spread it out so that it was encased into a square like so. And then I went through and took each individual design element from my site and put it into a square like that. I then went ahead and then combined those squares. So in this case, I set up a, a rectangle and then just went in and just grabbed two of those elements and combined them like so. And now when you go to one of my video pages, you can see how I added one of these elements to add some continuity to my site. And lastly, you can also add embed code to increase functionality on your site. So here you can see I have set up an Instagram page and I'm going to go ahead and select some space here for my embed code and drop that widget into the space. And it's now prompting me to add the code. So what I'm going to do here in this case is just go to my Instagram page. Uh, when you go to any Instagram post, you'll find three little dots next to it. Those three little dots will indicate that you can grab the embed code. So you're going to select embed. And then you're going to go ahead and just grab and copy that code. You're going to copy that code, go back to your site, and just paste that code right into the space there that's provided. Another little tip too, if you want to center your Instagram post and you don't want it to be flush left, which will show up by default, you can go to the very beginning of your code and then just use the double brackets to add the word center. And another bracket to close it out. That's at the very beginning and at the very end, you're going to do the same thing. Just put a slash before center. So I'm going to do bracket and then slash and then center, closing bracket. And that will center your text for you. So <clears throat> those are three things that can really help improve your universe website and move you on your way to doing some really exciting things. Uh, you can check me out at mindablepodcast.com. And you can check me out at youtube.com slash my podcast. Um, I will continue to post some more tips as I continue to explore the site because I'm sure they're going to continue to come up with some pretty nice features. Until then, see you next time.